All right, Bang Motor City Sports Talk and starting tomorrow, Monday, what is it, July 13th, you could be fined $500 if you don't wear your mask um, out in public. So let's talk about it. Hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. Um, I was at the doctor's office when I was listening to Gretchen Whitmere, uh, you know, make that press conference and basically they got to tighten up the mask. A mask can be 80, up to 85% uh, more effective during the coronavirus. So um, there are nine situations where you don't have to wear a mask. That is uh, kids under five eating at a restaurant. If somebody can't hear you, uh, you have to communicate personal services. What is that for? I think I named, um, I said religious services, uh, child daycare and camps. Um, you know, I said eating at a restaurant, um, you know, personal service. If you got to take it off to be identified uh, so people can see who you are. So there are, those are some of the ones that are, you know, that's on the list. Kids under five don't, don't have to wear masks. Um, so those are pretty much the the one. And also, if you exercise, you don't have to wear masks indoors, outdoors, if you ever open up the gyms. But I know a couple of gyms are still open. But, um, you know, they got to, you know, be strike, strict. And what you got to understand is this. It's always going to be people that's rebellious towards the rules. This can save your life. Well, I don't want to wear a mask. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do that. I mean, you got to wear it to save lives. If you don't care about your life, care about the next life, your kids, your mother, your father, your aunts, you have to wear these masks and you have to wear them outdoors and in crowded areas, not outdoors. If you're just walking, if you're in a crowded area, like a protest or, you know, a concert or whatever, um, you, and you can't maintain six feet, you have to wear it. So, I ain't opposed to it. Florida being rebellious towards it and people dropping dead and getting sick. It's a hotbed and they refuse to mandate the mask. I'm not mad at it. I wear my mask when I go in the grocery store. I might run in the gas station and forget my mask every now and again. So um, I got to do better as far as on that standpoint. I took the COVID test multiple times. A negative. I think I had it in February, man, for sure. Um, but, you know, just letting you guys know tomorrow, um, have your mask on, man. Have your mask on. All right, you don't want to get fined five hundred dollars. They was finding people at Rouge Park when they stay at home or they was up there partying and stuff of that nature. So it just ain't no reason, you know. But when you do things like this, you know, you mandate things. It's gonna be re people rebellious, like being in school. You know, it's just gonna be people that's gonna rebel against the rules, no matter if it's to save a life or not to save a life. And people saying, "I don't want to wear a mask. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do that." And okay, you know, what I'm saying you're gonna get this five hundred dollar fine. You get caught with again another five hundred dollar fine. So she doing what's best in this situation. Um, still mad at her for trying to walk everything back because at this point, it is what it is. You know, and the same people that's complaining about the mask, the same people that's getting this unemployment, don't want to go back to work, but they at indoor pools and they're they not wearing a the mask, they're not following the rules, they're still partying, they're still at, you know, after hours. That's what killed me, the hypocrisy. Just people want to stay on that unemployment uh, forever, bro. Like, come on. We need to get back to, you know, businesses doing things that we need to do. So we got to put these masks on so to eliminate the cause of COVID. So, you know, now she's breaking out the fine. She's being strict and I ain't knocking her for it because it ain't shit to put a mask on or a face cover on a bandana on. It ain't nothing about these, you know, these MX-95 masks. They sell them. I got one. We bought some at 12 Oaks Mall. They sell them at the gas station. They sell them at the car wash. You know, they sell them everywhere now. So. Um, just giving you guys a heads up, but those are the nine. It, those are the nine reasons where you don't have to wear the mask. Once again, I will try to remember it. There is kids under five. There is why restaurants eating. There are religious services communicating with somebody that can't hear you. Kind of pull the mask down. down. Um, there are exercising at daycares and day camps at six. Um, and it's a couple more of them that somehow I just can't remember right now. Um, hold on. Personal service. If you kind of got to wipe your nose, excuse me. Um, also, uh, while exercising and, um, that should be about almost about it. So, um, a medical condition as well too. If you got a medical condition where you can't wear them. So those should be the nine instances where you are exempt from wearing a mask. If they have to identify you as well too, if you got to go to the doctor's office, please pull you over, something of that nature. So uh, that's how they rocking out. Let me know what you guys think about the mandated rule. You can also be fined up to 500 buckaroos, dollars, blue faces, big faces. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. If you ever need to reach out, if you have a business question, quiet response, your video request, all the links in the description. 
Twitter's the fast way, then Facebook, then IG. You want to make a donation to the channel, best way to donate. If you haven't subscribed, commented, thumbs up, is to share the video, but also cash out PayPal description. One time for one time. This kicks in tomorrow, July 13th. We gone.